pool of water. Today we'll be focusing on leather. As you guys know, I have tons of leather items in my closet, bags, boots, and you know I love my boots. I mean, I could wear boots all year round. And over the years, I've invested a lot in many boots of different sizes, shapes, colors. And so I really, really want to get my cost per wear, regardless of how long I've had them in my closet. So over the years, I have learned the hard way, guys. Trust me, it took a lot of learning for me to finally get it into my head. I need a leather suede protector. And so I went into Stuart Wiseman, and this is the one that they chose for me. And I've been using it. I have gotten into the habit of protected my boots so as soon as fall hits or just before winter I would gather all of my boots yeah it takes a bit of time and place them in a nice circle on my balcony and I would set about my task of just showing them some love essentially showing them how much I love and appreciate the fact that they have protected my feet for so many years during weather conditions such as these. Oh my God. <laughs> Let's see if I could get over here. And going forward. And this is a testament to the fact that leather is a natural animal fiber and it's definitely a sustainable material and that is the reason why I have incorporated leather into my wardrobe but I am very well aware of the ethical concerns that are often associated with leathers like these because while I find comfort in the knowledge that leather is a byproduct of the meat industry. It is also often the case where animals are reared solely for their exotic leathers. We also cannot ignore the environmental impact that tanning has on the natural environment. Most companies worldwide use chrome, a very toxic chemical to tan their leathers so our gorgeous green orange brown and whatever color that you love these are often tanned using chrome and I often feel so guilty of loving colors but as I've said before it's something that we have to be aware of because chrome is very destructive and causes serious water pollution Sorry to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video so it's essential that we are well aware of these and i hope that you guys 
definitely learn something from this if and when you choose to buy leather it's very important that you choose brands that are that are open about where and how they get their leather whether it's from meat animals or whether it was grown solely for the purpose of getting the height as well as whether or not their leathers were veggie tanned or chrome tanned so that is one of the main reasons why guys I take so much care of my boots and this is the result of my work today these are all the boots I got done and this is how I've enjoyed wearing my boots for the past couple of years and I intend to have so much wear out of my boots for years to come so I hope you enjoy these looks and find some inspiration from when I tried my boots on with the many videos I've done for you guys for this year as well as many years ago. I hope you enjoy and I'll see you in the next one. I can't wait till I get you on the floor good looking uh, Hey, going out so hot just like an oven And I don't want to burn myself, I just had to touch it But it's so fine, and it's so fine Yeah, baby, and we don't mind all the watching Ha, cause if the study goes real close, they might learn something She ain't nothing but a little doozy when she does it She's so fine tonight You just got good jeans, so a nigga tryna cuff you imperfections because they are what make you unique and gorgeous thanks so much for watching love you guys and I'll see you in the next one take care bye bye